What are you catching the nose? This is named after De Gaulle, Charles De Gaulle. That's bright, that's fresh, but it also has a deep-seated maturity to it at the same time. Mm. 1941 vintage. In 1941, De Gaulle had left after France fell, personally proclaimed that he represents the French Republic when the whole thing had gone, moves to London, gives Churchill and everybody a huge pain in the ass because he's this cocky French guy saying, I am France. The, but, you know, he's got like a couple guys around him, but he insists that he's France, but gives France a, 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 a sense of that it was not yet conquered, that France continued, that free France continued. Correct. And comes back after the war, and this has some 1960s vintages in it, now he's president of France and did a great job in rebuilding it. So this glass is a monument to revival. Talk to me about the taste. This Armagnac to me is incredibly quintessential to what it means to be a well-aged Armagnac. Wow. The spirit of France, if you will. This is the spirit of France. This has such a great upfront, great character with a great wood backbone as well. And how much smoke do you get on this one? As I Incredibly light, right. incredibly light. <laughs> Hints it very nicely, particularly on the back of the palate. Does not overwhelm. Perhaps smells of a far off artillery barrage in the distance as mm. de Gaulle. The rumbling. Yes, precisely, the, as the rumbling barrage creeps. of the smoke of an artillery barrage. Present, persistent, not overwhelming. There's like a faint roar in the distance. So here's what we're, here's what we're saying. We've got 27, 28, and 29. Um, these are all pieces of history, truly. Uh, if you don't have a Bakta 50 and uh, you've got a couple of other bottles, you should try this. Uh, it's a unique flavor profile. It's a flavor profile that you're not gonna find anywhere else. And what else you're never gonna find, I would say, because nobody's crazy enough to do it, is taking these ancient French vintages, 1868 to 1970, average age of over 60 years old, and then giving them a kiss in a smoky French cask. Just a I mean, kiss. That's, that's something truly one of a kind. We forget how unique the Bacta 50 is. We really do. Is because it's called Bacta 50, 50 years old, but each one of these is from 1868 to 1970. They all are created by eight vintages. There are only 38 barrels released. Rare and unique doesn't even begin to scratch the surface uh, of just how rare these things are. Thank you.